Hey guys! Today's a very special, very, very, very special drinking game for you because it is going to be a cocktail based off the movie Cabaret. Now Cabaret is a 1972 classic musical film starring Liza Minnelli and was directed by Bob Fosse. It is a very, very great movie, probably one of my all-time favorites. It's one of the first actual musicals to really not be light and fun, and uh, that's what I love about it. So today we're going to be making uh, a drink that's my riff on the Ricky. Uh, the Ricky is a cocktail that was made right after Prohibition. Um, it is a mix of gin and bourbon. Uh, it's basically like as soon as Prohibition ended, they're like, how the fuck can we get drunk as quick as possible? Here's how. So let's begin. We're going to take a whole entire line that has been cut into fourths. We're going to place into the cocktail shaker. You're going to take a few slices of cucumber that have been cut up. Place those in there as well. Save one slice of cucumber and one slice of lime for garnish. You're going to take a wooden spoon or a muddler. I don't have a muddler, I have a wooden spoon. And you're going to just beat the ever-loving holy shit out of it. Just... Hear that sound? It sounds... Hear that? What's it sound like? We all know what it sounds like. Okay, enough. Then we're gonna put some mint simple syrup in there. Stop laughing, I swear. Can't do this. <laughs> then we're gonna put some mint simple syrup in there to help mask some of the flavor of all that booze. <laughs> then we're gonna start with the gin. I'm gonna go a little heavier with the gin because I'm more of a gin person in case you didn't already know. Stop! Okay, we'll use this because we're all <laughs> because we're all going fucking crazy right now. Uh, gonna do a three count. One, two, three. Okay, I need to regain my composure. Mm. Okay. I'm gonna do a soft three count of this, uh, and a one, and a two, and a three. That's very much how they do it in dance, and means you better do that shit quickly. Ain't that right, Miss Laura? I hope you're watching. All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to take that. We're going to already, we should already have a glass of ice filled up with a straw in it. I just fucking forgot to tell you that. Oh, it has been a week, I tell you. Oh, Lord of mercy. We're going to cover. We're going to shake. And my dumbass forgot to put a lid on this, so I'm just going to make a pop holder over it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. <laughs> Jesus Christ fucking dragons. All right. And then we're going to pour in here. There we go. And then we're going to truck it on over here because I forgot my soda water. <laughs> And I'm just acting like Liza at this point, you know, crazy old and drunk. And then we're going to fill it up with soda water. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Squeeze the lime. Put the wheel on there. Oh, fuck it. Put the wheel on there. Okay. So that did not really go according to plan, but who cares, because I'm laughing to keep from crying at this point. I think you all can relate. Now on to the drinking game. This is really a drinking game to the, for those of you that have seen this movie about a thousand times, because it's very specific, especially movement specific. You're gonna take a drink uh, every time a musical number starts. You're gonna take a drink every time the Kit Kat Club dancing girls look like they're just dead hookers behind the eyes. That's, uh, that was actually a Fosse specialty. It's called bullet eyes. They don't really see the men, they see the money, you know? It's like, look like dead hookers. Just like, poked out of their fucking mind. They probably were, in all honesty, it was the 70s. All right, moving on. We're gonna take a drink every time Michael York chews scenery. You're gonna take two drinks every time Michael York and Liza Minnelli are in the scene together and she upstages him and chews scenery like she's fucking Godzilla. I'm gonna take a drink every time Sally's green nail polish is shown. I think that's uh, the most iconic thing ever. I'm take a drink every time the MC says, does, says or does something obscene, anti-Semitic, and or crude. So basically every goddamn scene he's in. 
you're gonna take a drink every time Sally attempts to say something in German and it just sounds horrible. <laughs> like, girl, stop it. You do not sound German. You sound like you got balls in your mouth. <laughs> I crack myself up. Uh, take, uh, take a drink at the start of every musical number, so you'll be off, you know, to a good start there. Every, take a drink every time she tips or takes her hat off in my hair. That should get you drunk within the first 20 minutes of the movie. Take a drink whenever the drag queen uses the urinal beside Michael York, because that's just so fucking funny to me for some strange reason. Take a drink whenever Sally and Brian scream, scream at the trains, because that's just such a beautifully shot scene. Take a drink every time there is sexual tension between Sally... <laughs> Brian or Maximilian and or all of them. They could be all three at the same time. One of the only one of the first movies in Hollywood to introduce a thruple to people. There's that Fosse, that nasty motherfucker. May he rest in peace. Okay. Take a drink every time Liza drinks something. Take a drink every time during maybe this time, every time she just does something with her hands, like desperate grabs. I don't know what Liza was so desperate to fucking grab. Booze, pills, a man. Her mama! All right, where else? Okay, take a drink. Um, take a drink. And finally just, like, finish your drink and don't really don't make another one because I didn't really watch the rest of this movie. I just got kind of, like, drunk and watched it and decided to come up with some ideas. Take a drink during Tomorrow Belongs to Me, which is my favorite musical number in the entire movie because we're kind of fucking living it, aren't we? You know, Tomorrow Belongs to Me, Make America Great Again, Nazis, Trump. Kind of the same fucking thing. So, ladies and gentlemen, do a fossy neck, do a high kick, and drinky yo drink. <laughs>